Hello everybody, I'm Jenny with Budget Determined. Thank you for joining me for my journey. Today we're going to be cash stuffing my, oh my goodness, what week is it? Is it week two? I think it's week two <laughs> of my Etsy income as well as my side hustle money. We are working towards becoming debt free. I have chronic illnesses that will shorten my career as a whole. I have rheumatoid arthritis that is aggressive and it is not a fun journey, but we all have our personal challenges and we just have to deal with as such, I guess. So anyways, we are going to be counting this money and getting things going. Welcome back. If you've been here before, thank you for joining my journey. I am so, so honored to have you guys come along for the ride. You guys help keep me on track. My dogs are going nuts in the background and I, you hush. Hey, you hush. I don't know why they always do this. They always do this. I start recording and they start playing in the background. I don't know why. Okay. But anyways, today we are going to be stuffing 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 200, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, okay, 225. 30 of this is what I took for my Etsy income. Half of that, of course, will go towards debt. All of my Etsy income, I take half of it and use it to build up sinking funds, and the other half goes towards our debt repayments, um, snowball, avalanche, or whatever you want to call it. So we're just going to get this going. All right, you guys. <clears throat> Do you guys have anything fun that you guys have planned this year? I have actually started like a health journal for myself, trying to figure out what has negative results for me. Can you guys see that? Yes, you can. Okay. Negative results for my body, what, what triggers my flare-ups, etc. I know some of it, but I kind of want to fine-tune it and see where I can improve and do the maintenance and stuff that I need to. Okay, um, you guys are gonna think I'm crazy because I am going to add a dollar to every single one of the envelopes that I have, at least a dollar. I want to add something to every, every one of them and I don't have that much to put towards them this month. So I am just going to I, literally, I'm going, all this money here is designated for something else that you will see. So this $30 that I have in ones, I am going to use that to put a minimum of a dollar in every single envelope. I know that's probably crazy, but I don't know. I'm just, it's just going with my mood today. I just want to put something in there. So we have 5, 10, 15, now we have 16 in self-care. So as I was saying about my health journal that I am working on, clothing we have nothing in. I took my son shopping and had to buy him a brand new wardrobe and so we were kind of starting from scratch. I did spend the whole entire thing but not entirely on him. We ended up purchasing a little bit of clothing for my 10 year old as well. So now that one has $1. <laughs> I can math that much. Eat Out has $5. We're going to add $1. While I was taking my son shopping, my husband took the girls out to eat with this money to get some Subway. So, because they didn't want to make dinner at home. So that was fine. They had a little bit of a nice day together while we were out shopping. Okay. Kids. Oh my goodness, you guys. I keep getting sidetracked. Anyways, pause for a second. <laughs> Let's get this out of my mouth before I keep cutting the story even more. So, 
in my health journal that I'm doing, I have started a summer bucket list of things that I want to do that has nothing to do with chores, doesn't have to cost money, preferably doesn't cost, cost little to no money with our financial goals that we have. So I am wanting some ideas for things to add to my bucket list. I have things like sleeping out under the stars in the back of the pickup bed, like taking all the pillows and blankets and whatnot. Um, we live out in country, small town area. So that's kind of gives you an idea. Lots of woods and whatnot. We do hiking and I have some stuff like that. And it can be as simple as like sipping tea on the ice on Sip, yeah. sipping iced tea on my front porch, which I do have on my list right now. So any ideas that you guys have as possible low cost to no cost, little mini adventures or just enjoyable things um, that you guys enjoy to do, I would love to hear what you have. I still have some blank spaces to fill up and the summer is fast approaching. So in kids, we have 110 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and now 40. So 140, 119 of this at least is designated for my husband to take our oldest daughter that still stay, that still lives with us. We do have other kids that are older, but she's 16 years old and they are going to go on a daddy-daughter date this month. So that will be going down. Family time has 10 in it. Now it has 11. I'm not updating any of the trackers. I am just tossing the dollar in. All right, date night. I don't know when this is going to happen again, but be nice to sometime in the future. 25, 30, 6. Perfect. We're getting there. We don't have to have a whole lot of money to go on a date. We can even pack a picnic lunch and go up in the mountains. And that also is on my bucket, my summer bucket list. All right, all I have in here, have you done effed up? Oh, you guys. So again, um, not necessarily enough up on my husband's part, but So my husband just traded his truck for another truck and now that he's had it a little bit, there started to become a grinding, which is never a good sign. And one, two, three, four, five, six. It turns out that it needs about a thousand dollars of work done on the front end. Oh my goodness, you guys, I've been having a panic attack. It is taking me a few days to recover. Um, my husband told me about it and yeah, I think he was a little bit scared of me at first because <laughs> he knows how much and how focused I've been trying to make progress and it's been so difficult with the cost of living going up as much as it is. And since we are a low income, only get paid once a month household, Oh my goodness, it is so hard to make any kind of progress that really feels like a dent. And oh, I, I admit, I was not thrilled at first. And I'm trying to still sort it out. But it is what it is. And my husband has a plan of attack. Um, he has some stuff he's been, he's had on consignment down at one of the local shops here. And... He's had some offers that were lower than what he really wanted. Um, so he's trying to bargain with the people that have placed offers on things. And he thinks that that will cover most of it, if not all of it. Now, mind you, I was hoping that that money would go for some of the other goals that we had. But at least we have a plan of attack and it will get that done and checked off the list and I won't have to worry about it. I hate my list getting long. Okay, so in anniversary we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 5, 30. So 130, now we're gonna have 136, 137. We're gonna put $2 in this one. 
if I math right. Pets, this is for dog food, dog, dog treats, stuff like that. 50, 5, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. And thrift, we have yard sailing coming up this next month. I really want to add more to this. Doesn't have to be a crazy amount, but I do want to add more to this. We'll see. We'll see how our budget allows for this month. We have 5, 10, 15, 20, 21. I don't know. I just Am I crazy for just doing like the one dollar and adding, like just making sure that I add something to every single envelope this time? We have more weeks in the month that I will have some money, but I don't know. I, maybe it's just the mood I'm in. It's been so rainy, we've had hardly any days of sun. We've had a couple and they've been really nice and very short lived. In food stock up, we have 100, 20, 40, 50, 65, 70, 1. And I kind of want to go out hiking a little bit, but I kind of have to ease into it just because I'm really stiff in this weather. It's I really love the rain, but the rain does not love me, like, at all, so... 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26. 126 in school supplies. And in sports, if my fingers will work, 5, 6, and 7. This year, out of this one, I, I kind of do want to add um, a little bit over the summer in here because, oh my goodness, when we go to my son's sports events and stuff and sit on those bleachers, oh my goodness, they kill my butt. Like, it's those bleachers are not friendly at all. And so I'd like to get some of the, the sports bleacher seats. It would be so nice. So birthdays, 5, 10. Oh, that. How did I do that? Is that a little bit backwards? 20, 10. Ugh, I need more coffee. 20, 30, 40, 50, 5, 60, 1. Kind of all shifted off from each other, so they're being difficult. Gifts. Twenty, ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and nineteen. If you guys hear little jingles, that's my puppies walking around as their little collar tags. I can't really put them outside right now. Normally I try to put them outside. Oh, and now the sun's trying to come back out again. Because it was trying to rain a minute ago. 20, 40, 50, 5, 60, 1. We really gotta bulk up this one quickly. Those winter holidays come up on us fast. Vacation. This, we're really not going for a full vacation this year. We're just going to do one big family fun day for our vacation because we're trying to put the focus on debt repayment. But you got to have some fun or you're just going to burn yourself out. So you just have to budget for it and choose a reasonable amount and make it work. So 100, 200, 50, 70, 90. 310, 330, 350, 
5, 10, 15. So 415. Oh, 416 and 17. Let's put two in that one. Our goal for our day is $1,000 and we're hoping around August. So we still have a few months to add to that one. Uh, what is the fuel price where you guys are at? Um, and if you guys would share your state, I'm in Idaho and right now the fuel is like around $4.60 a gallon, give or take a little bit, depend on where, you, where you're at. So in medical, we have 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43. I hope I counted my envelopes right and I'm doing the math right. Eesh. I just want to bulk up all of these and I can't do it all without adding to all of them. 10, 20, 25, eh, nope, 26. This one shouldn't need to use that one super soon here, but when we do use that one, it takes up a lot really fast. So the dental one, any of the medical ones, really the vision, oh my goodness, glasses, contacts, LASIK, whatever you're after, it's all so expensive. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. 46. <clears throat> yeah, we got our regular like 3% raise or whatever this last year. And but the cost of living has gone up so much that we actually went backwards in the progress that we can make with our income and cost of living. It's crazy, crazy. Are you guys in the same boat? I'm sure at least most of you guys are. <coughs> Excuse me. I need to drink water. Hang on. Okay, that's better. <clears throat> My throat was a little bit dry. Neighbors have been cutting grass and <clears throat> allergies are kicking in. 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23. And home decor. Uh, the thing that I'm hoping to save up for in here is I don't know. I think I need like three fifty or four hundred dollars with tax and everything. I want to get a TV stand that has like the electric fireplace in it. They used to have a fireplace in our house that we live in, um, but they remodeled it prior to us buying it, and they took the wood stove out and they put in. Um, heat pump and central air and stuff. So home maintenance, we have 100, 50, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 5, 80, 5, 90, 5, 300? Wow. And five, is that right? 150, 200, 20, 40, 60, 70, yeah. Nice. 300. I like that. That one's adding up better than I thought. Oh. You guys are going to correct me if I don't do this. I almost missed the one. Hmm. <laughs> Are any of the rest of you guys doing a staycation this summer? I think we've done a staycation for the last I don't know how many years, but we can't get very much time off of work and finances, of course, we're focusing on debt repayment. Um, so 5, 10, 12, 13, 
13. And finances, since our focus is debt repayment, is definitely keeping us local as well. All right, vehicle, we have 20, 30, 31. We're just going to keep rebuilding this one. We'll see what, we'll see if we have to pull anything from here to cover stuff with my husband's truck or not. It's not an immediate repair, so I don't, I don't know the timeline in which that's going to happen, but I'll let you guys know. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. New driver, this is prepping for my son's driver's ed next year and his vehicle match pets this is their emergency fund and it looks like i have money not in the order that i want it don't know how i do this because the way i count is big bills to small bills but you know 20 30 40 50 55 60 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, and 79. Emergency savings. This one I don't normally put cash in. I have, I have a thousand um, placeholder in here. And for the money in the bank. And I do have emergency savings cards in there that I haven't really done much with. I do need, I used this as an example on my page, and I need to start using it in here. Maybe that would, that's, I should probably start doing that. At least fill $10 a month in here on top of the hundred dollars that I transfer into my savings on online. I don't know. I'll figure it out. So five, six. I'm just kind of putting money in here as I can. We already have the initial thousand, but as you can see, But we're hoping to build it to 5000 by the end of the year between savings challenges and setting aside cash. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11. Oh, you guys. How did I do that? I still have a 1. Where do I want to put it? I'm going to put it in the new car match and new driver just because I know that he is starting to aggressively save and this boy of ours can definitely save and so I don't know what we're going to be ending up car matching because whatever he saves we're going to save and match so if he saves $500 we're going to put $500 towards his first car so that's what we did with our other children and we're going to continue to do so we have him and then one other to go for vehicles and driver's licenses so yes it's gonna be a busy one all right you guys I I don't know I'm kind of torn on this one and I will explain why so this is my savings challenge envelope, right? Yeah. So, <laughs> this we were working on since March. Love a leprechaun savings. Save us $115. Now, I've been working on this, and yes, I know, we're definitely not in March anymore. We are in May, but you do things as fast as you can or as slow as you need to whatever it works so I actually decided to include these in my savings challenge which make it to where I, 
have saved 134. I believe these add up to 18 if I if my memory is serving me right. So we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 10, 15, 16. So yes, 18 to go. I am going to add doo -doo -doo -doo, a 20. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30, 5, 36. So I have $2 extra because I put in a 20 instead of the 18. So we're going to get that colored. Now you guys, I, I am struggling here and I know that you guys are going to tell me what I should do and I know I'm just being a little bit juvenile here, but this money for the savings challenge, it's supposed to go towards my medical savings and now with my medical savings I am instead of going to the specialist physical therapy and stuff for my arthritis and stuff because I wasn't happy with their billing system and the way that they charge things and whatnot but so like I said I'm keeping the health journal and I'm kind of keeping track of things and creating my own medical plan and I use the money in there to purchase different aids and whatnot that I need such as acupuncture or whatever I've never had acupuncture but I really want to try that this year and I hear good things from it I've had the needling the dry needling where they stab the needle in and then they wiggle it around to activate the muscle and help it release which is awesome Ta-da! Look at that! It's all done! Alright, hang on just one second. I'll continue with this because I forgot to grab something before I did this. Alright. Okay. So this is the money that I set aside last week. That's my dog trying to sleep. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Because I have a bill that I have to pay this month. And it's pretty much $300. Right? Okay. So that's 100. And out of this, I am taking 1, 2, 3, or five so 20 40 60 80 100 so that makes 200 and see that doesn't hurt that's that's okay I feel accomplished there so now in my medical I have 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 200 I still have a hundred to go right but you guys you guys okay this money. I did a savings challenge for it. I want to do something fun with it. I don't want to put it... <laughs> I don't want to put it towards a bill. Whew. But I am going to lecture my inner child. <sighs> Ugh. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. This why does it hurt? I don't want to do this. Like, why is this so miserable when this wasn't? I just... Because this was play, and this was just business, and... <sighs> I don't want to do that. But, at the same time... There's the money. That bill is now paid. I don't owe this debt anymore. So, that is good. I'm sucking it up. <sighs> so, but it's so fun. Ugh. Okay, setting that money to the side. That bill's paid. 
That's one challenge down. 20, 30, 5, 36. And we're just, we're just going to go ahead and add it to my medical right now. Let's just do it. And then this money I can use for everything that I was just talking about that I would have liked to have used the whole entire challenge for. So we're adding 36 to this now because that's what's left over after paying the bill. 20, 30, 5, 40, 5, 50, 5, 60, 5, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 79. Okay, that's not horrible. It's not what I wanted though, but I can't do this. Ah! Sorry, my fingers are not working. All right, adulting done. It was very, very painful, but that is done. And that's one bill that will not go into collections. So, yay. This one's now empty. I'm going to leave it here because I'm going to be doing more challenges, but I don't know exactly what yet. And I don't know that I'm going to start them right, right away just because I have some progress to make on some others. Okay. This is my 300 challenge. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 200, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. So we need 60 more in here to color that mushroom, and then this one will be done. So that is what we are going to do. 20, 40, 60. See, I like this. I like this. I just don't like adulting. Okay. Color, color, color. I really like mushrooms. I don't know. I love anything nature though, so. All right. And then let's do a little bit of blue. A little bit of red. I like colors. You wouldn't know by my wardrobe though because I don't wear a supremely a lot of colors. I wear certain tones, but Not a lot, a lot. Yay! That one is done too. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 300. Okay. So this 300 challenge, where did I say it was going to go? I said it was going to go in that winter holiday one. I said that we need to bulk up and get busy on, and it is not in this binder. It is in this binder. Because there's something wrong with me. All right, here we go. Getting her done. Okay. So now in holidays we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 80, 93, 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 66. So I said 66, yes. So what did I say here? 366.
Or is that 466? I think it's 360. It was 366, yes. I haven't been very aggressive at adding to that one, but doing the challenges has definitely helped. Oh, much better. Much better. She threw through it. Okay. So we finished two savings challenges this week. That's exciting. Now maybe I can accomplish some of these other ones. My goal is to add, is to put money in every single one of the savings challenges this month. All right, and here's my wall of debt, $15, which we half of my SE income. We have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 10, 15, uh, I have a 10 here. 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 1, 2, 3, so 43, 143. We're almost halfway to another icon. Each icon equals $300. I can wipe this off with alcohol pad um, when I've completed this. No, we're not paying off this 23,900 this year. Our goal is hopefully to get it down to 14,000, but that might be a little bit aggressive, especially with these things that pop up, such as vehicle repairs and whatnot. But we're gonna see and we're gonna do as best we can and any progress is a victory, right? So, woohoo. So that is all that we are doing this week, you guys. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm sorry this one's a little bit longer. Um, I might edit out a little bit to shorten it, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of got a little bit talkative and a little bit jibber-jabbery. Anyways, I will see you guys next time. You guys have a great day. Stay magic.